Right, good evening and welcome back to another Funfair Crazy video here on Coast of Crazy YouTube channel. Yeah, I, I seem to change the uh, the opening title every time I start a new video, but yeah, we're in Shrewsbury. We've just done the, uh, the, uh, the prison tour, which was absolutely amazing. I hope you enjoyed the video again. It's something different. It's not everyone's cup of tea, but it's an attraction. It's worth filming and it's worth showing you guys what's out there if you've never experienced anything like that. I've never been to a, a prison before and had a look around but uh, yeah you'll just see the uh, amazing coffee shop there behind me so I've just got myself a generic uh, haz hazelnut latte it's very hot <laughs> and it's very nice I just thought I'd show you this area before we go over to the fair which doesn't open for another 10 minutes we've got this beautiful dairy ice cream here in the old vintage truck that's really really nice there all different ice creams and drinks and stuff there the little coffee shop there is really nice. They also do ice creams. I just want to show you this here. It's absolutely stunning around here. I've never been to Shrewsbury before. It's absolutely gorgeous. You've got the River Seven just there, and it actually goes all the way around. I think it's a town. It could be a city. I'm, I'm going to have to look into Wikipedia. You can just hear the first kicking off over there. I think they're testing the rides and things. There's a brand new coaster for me to, to get on. It's not brand new, but it's a, a new sort of coaster credit for me it's one of those minor mics I only ever done one of those and it was in Mabel Thorpe so they got one of those I don't know if I can get on it I'll have to get there quick before it fills up with people that are all staring and pointing at me and there's a ghost train I don't think I've done before it's literally just over the trees they've got an orbiter they've got a waltzer they've got a twist um, we're probably there for a couple of hours and then we're going back to the hotel which we've been staying at near Telford for a couple of nights uh, so like I said we've come up to North Wales and we stayed at the Talardi which is a Marsden's hotel it's very nice it's sort of in between like a travel lodge and a premier inn that sort of style hotel very nice so we've had a couple of days in North Wales uh, we're actually going back on Saturday which is tomorrow because one of the things that we wanted to do was the uh, Snowdon Mountain Railway which was fully booked all week so we've had to book it for Saturday afternoon but before we go to that there's the two credits I still need to get the one at Rill, um, the, the children's park I don't know if it's going to open or not because it looked pretty derelict when we were there the other day and the one on Landudno Pier as well but yeah before I get into the vlog and show you what else there is here there's this beautiful bridge uh, so this is the second bridge um, of the day, but there's a um, poster for the fun fair. Looks really old, so it looks like they've been here a while. Uh, I've obviously changed it, but yeah, there's the dates for it. So by the time I get the uh, the, the vlog up, this is probably gone because I, at, at the moment I've still got a load of videos to upload. I'm still in the process of uploading uh, any Gelandia vlog, and then there's the salt mines, the Legendia. There's all the other. There's two other fun fairs, Polish fun fairs. But yeah, there's a bridge here opened in 1922 and just before this and the prison we actually went to uh, Iron Bridge where they've got uh, the world's first Iron Bridge uh, which is stunning again follow the Facebook page and you'll see the pictures that I've uploaded but yeah Shrewsbury is absolutely stunning got my favorite trees just there the uh, weeping willows I like to fill my uh, park up on roller coaster tycoon so yeah, I'm gonna drink me coffee um, and then we'll get into the fair. So hope you enjoy the vlog from uh, Shrewsbury. Uh, Quarry Park is the name and I think it's a Jennings Fun Fair. Right, so this uh, wagon next to me that's selling the ice creams is the Sentinel Steam Wagon, um, which is made in Shrewsbury and was sold worldwide. Um, the first industrial steam engine was invented by Thomas New come in 1712. Um, I don't know how old this is. Um, Sentinel made steam lorries, locomotives, and rail cars in Shrewsbury from 1950 until 1958. So, yeah, it's a steam powered wagon. I'm quite surprised Joby Carter's not got one of these in his collection of steam engines. But, yeah, very nice is that. Alright, so walking over to the fair. Before we go in, I'll stick the poster on the side just there for you you can have a look at that yeah like I said this fair's probably gone but it's here for two weekends so it might still be here 
by the time I get the vlog up. Uh, I'm quite behind with vlogs as you've noticed because I spent a whole two weeks just filming loads of stuff obviously uh, starting with Polden. Uh, there's a good Bowden there. <laughs> Yeah, started with Poland first and then North Wales, but here we go, here's the fair, it's not very busy at the moment, it's just opened literally like five minutes ago, yeah five minutes ago, so I'll show you what's here, if you follow my Facebook page, uh, Coaster Crazy, then you would see that I've already been here before, like a couple hours ago, well, in fact three hours ago, come and took some pictures uh, I've just gone through my comments as well on that exact post and somebody just put yeah there's a fair on this Shrewsbury Quarry Park I'm like yeah I know I, I, I mentioned that <laughs> that's what the post was about it was about visiting a couple of historical attractions today starting with the Iron Bridge which I didn't film a vlog of I just took some pictures and um, then we went to the prison and now we're at the fair and I posted it all in one post and here we go, there's a coaster credit for me here, so I need to get on this quick if they allow adults on it. It's a minor mic, I've only ever done one of these and it was in Mablethorpe, I think it's still there. I don't know if adults are allowed to go on it or not. But yeah, minor mic. Um, Wisdom Rides normally make these, a very popular ride in America, you find them in like shopping centres or shopping malls, that sort of thing. But it's a tiny little coaster, it's actually called Railroad Crossing. I think, that's what it says there. Railroad Crossing, but you've got, he's got your, uh, your, your generic Disney characters on the back there. But yeah, it's, an, it's a minor mic. Wisdom Rides. See if it says anything about Wisdom Rides on the trailer. But no, I've, that, this is the first travelling one of these I've seen in, on a fair. So I've got to finish my coffee and I'll get on there. I'll show you what else is here as well. It's not a massive fair, but... There's a couple of good unique rides here actually, you've got the Miami there at the back uh, A few juvenile rides in the middle, so you've got the Sizzler over there Dodgems, a ghost train I don't think I've ever been on before I, I, don't, I don't remember seeing this anywhere This looks really good Come in if you dare oh, yeah. We're doing this, definitely, £2.50 a ride. I need to ask him if it's been anywhere that I know of. Yeah, it looks really good, this. Yeah, uh, S and J Dobson Amusements. So yeah, this whole fair is um, it's put on by Jennings. we got a fun house just here as well. Another couple of juvenile rides here, you've got the, the little carousel just going around, it's quite cute. Uh, bouncy castle at the end of the corner, uh, the trampolines, Thunderdome waltz are there at the end, uh, and an orbiter. So yeah, not a bad lineup of rides really, like I said it's run by Jennings, that's what it says on the poster. Definitely do the coaster, the ghost train, the waltzer see what else we can get on but yeah we won't be here for long Ooh. here we go little minor mic uh, coaster I'm just saying I don't have to worry if we get here early about people laughing at me but the operator's laughing at me it's like what is he doing on here <laughs> but yeah, it's, um, it's basically like the one of the little runaway mine train coasters. So it's on a, on a trailer, the same sort of layout, but it's a minor mic, it's got the minor mic front end on it. It's a little powered coaster, it's alright actually. There's no lap bar or anything, it's just a, just a seat belt. <laughs> yeah. A cred, a cred! Everyone's looking at me like, what is he doing on there? <laughs> Two pound a ride! Can't go wrong with that. So the past couple of weeks, like I said, we should have been in Florida, and I can't remember off the top of my head how many new coasters I would have got on that trip, but the past couple of weeks, uh, going to Poland, and then North Wales, and now this fair, and there's a couple of other fairs we're doing as well. Um, I've got quite a few credits, so yeah, it wasn't a little bad coaster, that.
Right, there you go. Um, I've done the coaster. I've now got a really wet bum <laughs> from sitting on it. From sitting, from sitting on it. I have to start walking like this now. If you know, you know. <laughs> um, yeah, from behind it probably looks like I've weed myself. But no, it was good, it was alright. Probably could have done with going around a few more times. I said the one at Mabel thought um, goes backwards really quick. She said, yeah, this one used to go backwards, so I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, it was alright, it's another credit. Right, next up is a really cool looking ghost train. No idea if I've done this. Uh, if you think I've done it, comment down below, but I do not recognise this at all. But uh, yeah, hopefully it's a new ghost train. £2.50 a ride, bargain. We have been expecting you. Yeah, uh, ghost train crest. Oh, it's one of Steve Ray's faces. Oh, it's pitch black in here. I've never been on before. This is definitely one of them that I've never been on before. It looks so fresh. Like, it looks like he's spent a lot of money on this, doing it up. It's really good. It's like the old classic um, layout that Joby Carter, not Joby Carter, um, the one that travels with Carter's, um, a, a Caddles one. It's very similar to that. Very, very good. Uh, it's a good little jump scares in there. Uh, UV paint, um, smoke at the end. It's quite a decent size actually as well. It goes out quite a bit. But yeah, very nicely presented. I think it's probably one of my favorite of that size actually in the UK. Just ask the operator, like where do you normally travel to? And he, he says basically just mainly the Midlands. So I know for a fact I haven't done it because I haven't done a lot of Midland fun fairs before. So yeah, that was really good. Unless I have done it before and I've completely forgot and you know that I've been on it, just comment down below. Well, yeah, I feel, I feel like I've weed myself. <laughs> the back of my shorts are soaking wet. Anyway, another ride. I've done a waltzer for a while. It's Thunderdome. I don't think I've done this one either. This is old school, this. Another £2.50 ride. Right, here we go on Thunderdome. Let's see what this one's like. I don't think I've done this one before. Oh. Ah. Woo. 
try to get some off-ride footage I walked up the steps and the guy's like get down get down all right <laughs> I'll get down <laughs> no it was a good ride it was all right uh, yeah like constant speed the young lads were spinning it it was all right I think next so we're going on the uh, the orbiter like a good orbiter done quite a few of these now uh, got a couple of girls looking at me now <laughs> but yeah another two pound fifty ride here <laughs> Right, here we go on the orbiter. <laughs> yeah, done a few of these now. One that normally travels with Scarrex. It's one of my favourites. And done one of these for a while. In fact, the last one I did was in Milton Keynes at Willard Lake. What a lovely location this is in this park here. I wanted to do the one in Poland last week, but you just didn't have time. Oh man, some power on this already. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I just wish we had more brake dancers in the UK. I mean, we've got the one at Ocean Beach, the South Shields, but when you go to those European fairs and you see those brake dancers, they're just amazing. people on it now but uh, I don't want to wait any longer really it looks pretty cool though. I might give it a go in a minute but, uh, I might go and do the, uh, the sizzler I've still got a wet bum <laughs> they're in it <laughs> they're in it <laughs> well, I did the, uh, the sizzler but, yeah, the, uh, I've still got a wet bum from the coast it's right Trying a little bit. I think the ghost train is probably my favourite ride here. Might do that again. A really cool sizzler just here. Won't be here much longer here. Really. I mean, well, we've been here an hour. <laughs> no, not even an hour. It opened at five. It's quarter to six now. This is a fast ride. Sit back. Hold tight. Here we go. Uh, it's a fast ride on the Sizzler. Yeah, I've probably got to make this my last ride. I might do the Ghost Train again because it was well good. But yeah, this has got to be my last spinny ride. I'm starting to feel a bit nauseous, nauseous if I'm honest. <laughs> I'm not used to it. Should have done more rides in Poland. 
just didn't have the time. Yeah, I've never, never done this one before, I don't think. It's incredible how many fairs are on at the moment around the UK. It's just, there's one in Knutsford as well at the moment. Knutsford isn't that far away. And then you had the, uh, the Whit Whitney Feast Fair. That was a couple of days. Uh, that was, when was that? I think it was last week, was it? I can't remember now. Thursday, Friday, something like that. We was in North Wales. And then you've got one in... Uh, one in Beck Is it Beaconsfield this this weekend? I don't really know, but... Yeah, I might be going to another one on Sunday. But there's just so much content. I need to get everything edited and uploaded because... I'm running out of uh, SD card memory space. <laughs> so many vlogs I've filmed in the past couple of weeks, it's ridiculous. Has this got to speed up? constant speed at the moment nearly three minutes I suppose you got your money's worth of this face it's all right so I'll definitely do that ghost train again and then I've got to make a move like I said we're staying in a hotel near Telford and it's if I'm, if I'm being brutally honest it it's awful, it's one of the worst hotels I've ever stayed in, it's horrible. It's like Spiderville. We walked into the entrance and there was a spider as big as my hand. Awful, absolutely awful. I think it, it's called a book, book of tree arms or something like that. for about five seconds so just before I turn the camera back on yeah, it was all right nice gentle ride I suppose uh, go and have another go at that ghost train now yeah the uh, sizzler there was was all right it was just like a constant speed and then it did speed up for about five seconds and then stopped <laughs> so yeah i've got to do the ghost train again over there I'm, I'm done for extreme rides i mean you've got the the miami here and the uh, the dodgems i haven't been on but that's it i'm only missing two rides out <laughs> yeah the miami looks pretty cool there's only two girls on there yeah, come on, let's take you there one more time, right over oh, the top. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Plenty of air time on that one, though. Yeah, go and do the ghost train again, I think. And then I've got to make a move. Like I said, we're up, we're up early in the morning because we're going back to North Wales to do a couple of coaster credits there I missed out on during the week because they were closed. Um, and then we're doing the mountain railway. And then that's probably about it. And then I've got a fair on Sunday, if I feel up to it. And then the whole, then I'm back to work. I managed to get all these vlogs edited and uploaded because as I'm speaking, I've probably got about 15 videos to upload. <laughs> it's crazy. By the time this is on, it's probably well gone. But yeah, a nice little fair, really. Really, 
Cow Shred, one of the best of this scale I've done before. I was awesome. Right, there you go, final ride of the night for me with the Ghost Train. Really good, that's actually one of my favourites of that scale. Um, really good um, like effects in there, UV paint, uh, there was smoke in there the second time I did it, so I'm glad that I did it the second time. And there's just loads to it, it doesn't just go in and out like that, snakes, and then it's got a bit more and yeah, a good little layout to it. But that's it, I'm done other than the Miami and the, the Dodgers, which I said I'd end up going on my own. Uh, I think I'm done, I've done quite a lot here. Got a new coaster credit, got a new ghost train credit, new waltzer, orbiter, every ride I've done here, I've never done before. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> but that's it, we're off. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this one. Uh, don't forget to comment, like and subscribe, hit the notification bell for next time I upload another video. And yeah, it's the, uh, the, uh, the World Funfair uh, month at the moment. Uh, like I said, I haven't really promoted it, but yeah, go out there and support your local showman. And from Shrewsbury, Quarry Park and Jennings Funfair, I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.